and get your kiss on. Okay, I cannot do this ah! one-handed. Moving on to the next part of the vlog. Obachan's got the, the clean thing. <laughs> got the pink, the nice jeans, the slippers. Obachan looking bougie. Okay. <laughs> what you trying to in the old school look? Nothing too special. Lie. All right, what's up, my quesadillas? It's 11 o'clock right now. Today is a very special video because I'm going to be going to my first ever real day dance battle this is going on from like midnight to the morning so this is some real underground jab shit right here ladies and gentlemen it's gonna get turned it's gonna get lit it's gonna get spicy so let's have some fun tonight grab some popcorn let's get lit so how i got into this is a quesadilla messaged me he said he lives in tokyo and he wants to hang out and i saw that he was a dancer and he goes to dance battles and stuff like that and all the dancers i've been seeing in these battles are very intimidating like very scary, but you know what? I'ma just man up and I thought, hey, I'ma try to get in on this. So I messaged him, hey, can I get in one of these battles? So yeah, it's gonna be lit, it's gonna be fun. I'm probably gonna get my ass spanked, but I'm just gonna get groovy, I'm just gonna have fun. But yeah, I just took a shower, gonna go meet up with him in Shibuya, so see you then. All right, so what's up? I just met up with this quesadilla right here. He's Yuki, he's a- uh, I do hip hop, um, in my own company right now. Oh, okay. uh, yeah, yeah, I'm an engineer. Oh shit. I didn't yeah. even know that. Explain how you learn English. I think your story. Oh yeah, I was cool. born in Houston, but I grew up in Tokyo, so I went to like, you know, just like native um, English school, like whole my life, okay. so, and then just I just like catch up with this English. So. And then I'm with Takumi right now. He's just a <laughs> yeah. He's just a normal Japanese boy, but he lived in France too, so he's got some French dancing in him. So I don't know. I'm excited to see what happens. I'm yeah. excited to see Let's see all go. the dancing that goes on tonight. So I'm here now. There's some cool dancers here. Everyone just kind of laying loose, kind of showing a little bit of what they got. Hey. Yeah. 
<laughs> I just danced in the cypher, the freestyle circle. I mean, I did okay. I didn't go off, but like, I didn't fail, so I just kind of did my thing. Honestly, though, this definitely woke me up. There's hella good dancers out there. Like, I came here to have fun, but I mean, holy sh Man, it's hard to keep up with these people. One thing I realized is I need to work on my footwork. I'm really good at waves. I'm good at popping. I'm good at hitting the beats and stuff like that. But, like, I need to work on my creativity and then my footwork. Because people are, are, like, moving all around the dance floor. They're going everywhere with their footwork. I need to start learning more. So now I'm, like, backstage. I'm in this locker room area. It's pretty cool. All right, so what's up? I'm in, like, the backstage locker room right now. These are all my Japanese dancer friends that I just met. Introduce yourself. Hey, the only I can't lie, I know. What's up, bro? I'm Brita, yeah! Hey! Yay! 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 I'm Dragon! Dragon! <laughs> hey! What's up, bro? I'm Dopey! Yeah! Dopey! Hey. 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 Oh, hey guys! Where's the bro? Hey! Where's the bro? I'm Toshi! Toshi is Chojo's this. He's really good, basically, so, yeah. So, there was a judges showcase, all the judges performed, they were crazy good. Now it's moved on to the second round. Before it was a cypher, which is like a circle of people, and a dancer each goes in one by one. Now they're doing one-on-one -on -one battles, so it's more personal, more lit. I didn't get in the second round, unfortunately, but you know what? At least we're staying hydrated. That's all that matters, folks. In all seriousness, though, I learned a lot. I just gotta start practicing more, keep dancing. Dancing's one of my passions, one of my fun pastimes, my hobbies. I just like to plug in listen to music most of high school i listened to music more than i did lectures i was actually very quiet in school i was that kid that just plugged in all day and i'd just be kind of like grooving in class i can actually dance though i wasn't that emo kid that was about to shoot up i was like that cool dancer kid that's obviously in his own little world that was me into the music i hated sitting through classes and stuff it's so boring music was the thing that got me through it and please don't be influenced by me i'm just telling you guys what i did the only reason i could do that is because i got youtube i was not good in school school okay no colleges wanted me that's half the reason i'm doing youtube because this is the only thing i can do I'm, I'm, I'm truly so grateful for youtube though i can't imagine myself doing anything else seriously <laughs> nine to five and again please don't be influenced by me don't quit your job and start youtube you won't make it i'm barely making it okay but really though youtube's always been like a hobby to me and i remember my dad told me hey son uh you're obviously shitty in school you should probably start taking youtube seriously i was like yeah you know what i'll do that before it was a hobby i wasn't making videos that often but now i'm making youtube my number one priority and taking care of my grandparents obviously but youtube is my main thing now and now that it is my number one priority it is working out so i'm I mean, thing is, I know how YouTube works. I've done this for six years. I know like all the ins and outs of this site. It's truly a game. I could give a full on hour lecture on how to be a YouTuber and how YouTube works. I'm probably not the most trustworthy person saying that, but trust me, if I really wanted to, I can get up to a million subscribers real quick. I'd just rather do what I want to do and just have fun with it. It's working out, so why not? But yeah, I gotta start practicing dancing too, cause uh, dancing has also been one of my big passions, so gotta do that too. This dude is really good, but the other girl is too, and she looks Thank you all doing it. Yeah.
down in the gutter, so hot you get hurt if you don't rock and roll. Leave the weapon like Mel Gibson and Danny Glover, just push rock. They will take it over your block. Gangster, show me love, and suckers they get shot with my 9mm mental. When I touch it, it melt. Beats are fixed, it ain't coincidental. When I was burning trees, I used to mine and walk. Sometimes I drink so I'm not like you get better. By the way, props to this kid, he's enthusiastic. What's up, my quesadillas? It's like 5 o'clock now in the morning. The dance battle just ended. And now I'm trying Japanese McDonald's for the first time. I'm so tired, man. This has been a journey. Overall, though, battle was pretty fun. It was, the vibes were pretty nice. Honestly, it would be way more lit if it was not during sleeping hours. About to eat this McChicken muffin thing. I don't even know. It's breakfast only right now, so it's good, though. It's good. Alright, what's up everyone? Filming the day this is uploaded. I just want to say, there was a lot of stuff in the night that I didn't record, which kind of made up for a lacking in content vlog. I don't know. But I just want to say a huge shout out to Yuki. He was a real nice guy. We had like a two hour talk at McDonald's and we just talked about YouTube and I mean, he knew me, but he wasn't like a huge fan. Like he watched my videos. He was just an average quesadilla. But as I told him my mentality and like my life story, my dreams, goals, like what I want to do, I could tell like the respect level just went up a lot. So and yeah, he offered to help out with videos whenever I need. So my respect for him went up a lot too. So I just want to say thank you so much, Yuki. And yeah, now that I'm looking back at that night i also realized something i can dance to any music with the beat but i usually dance to like trap music just trendy soundcloud rap trap! with lyrics and like vibes you know i dance to vibes and the songs in the battles were like very basic just hip-hop battle music which i'm not really used to dancing to i guess like when it comes to that i can only just pop to the beat and just do my basic like waves my creativity usually comes from lyrics and just the way the song feels and these songs were just like pretty much beats so so all i could really do is just hit the but yeah this whole event inspired me to just practice a lot more dance so yeah overall it was a really good night i hope you guys enjoyed the video make sure to like and subscribe and click the little ding dong to know when i upload and i like dancing peace